Hi everyone, today for the October Book Talk, I'll be talking about a realistic fiction book called The Fault on the Stars. This book is the sixth book in, written by John Green, who also wrote Paper Towns and Will Grayson, Will Grayson. I'll start off with a quote from the book. <clears throat> Sometimes you read a book and it fills you with this weird evangelical zeal and you become convinced that the shadow world will never be put back together unless and until all living humans read the book. I chose this quote because it is true and I also agree with it. I also make the person assume that the book has something to do with other books, which is totally true. The main protagonists in this novel are Hazel Grace and Augustus Waters. This story is set in America. Hazel is a 16-year-old girl who has thyroid cancer, which has spread to her lungs. This is why she has to bring a can of air everywhere she goes. Augustus is a 17-year-old boy and has osteosarcoma, which has caused him to lose his leg. <clears throat> the two meet for the first time at his cancer support group and immediately bond with each other after the meeting. Um, they meet and exchange their two favorite books and tell each other to read them. Augustus is given the book about a girl who struggles with cancer called an imperial affliction. He is frustrated that the book abruptly ends and it without a conclusion. This is when both of them go and try to find the author of the book, Van Houten, to ask him about the ending. <clears throat> when Augustus is a bit hesitant to hang out with Hazel, um, she looks up his ex-girlfriend and finds out that she died of brain cancer. Hazel then refers to herself as a bomb as she fears hurting him when she dies. Um, the theme of this book, I think, is friendship as Hazel and Augustus have been through a lot together and Hazel also says that she would trade anything for, in the world for the short time that they have been together. I would really recommend this book to anyone who likes realistic fiction and a bit of romance. This is particularly a sad book, but also very interesting as well. I love this book because you would want to read what was on the next page as you finish one. Um, I would call that unputdownable. Thank you. And 